Check it out. Hustle Man is in the house. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. What's up YouTube, it's your boy Hustle Man back with another video. So today, I'm gonna go to as many as Goodwill stores as I can in this neighborhood, in this city, and see if I can find the best deal where I can make the most profit on. But I'll check with you guys. I'll check, check with you guys uh, when I get inside and uh, let's see what we can find. A few moments later, Let's go see what we can find. Before I go to my next store. Look at electronics. watch $3.99 let me look up comps on that real quick eBay guys give you guys some tips so you can generally scan a barcode but this one does come up so it's probably old it's crap but Let's see if I can find it this way. Generally, you can just take a picture of it. And see. There's one for $19. $9, $43, There's one for $112. So we're gonna go to sort or filter, go for sold. I don't know, sometimes YouTube, I mean eBay be screwing up, now it doesn't say sold items. Sometimes it shows up, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know what's going on with that. But anyway, that's $3.99. I'ma pass on it. Let me see, what is this? Electric crossword puzzle. Cheryl to the office, please. Cheryl to the office. $3.99. Hold on guys, let me. Let me check back with you guys in a second. Let me look up this item. A few moments later. These work. Well, they could have been decent. Well, they're not in good that great or shape. These are vans. I usually buy vans, but they're kind of worn. So I'm going to pass on those. Uh, this store is not really known for good shoes but what they do that but they keep them behind the counter they they keep the really good ones behind the counter that way they mark them up they mark them up uh, I will take a take a chance on these converse but men's shoes and women's shoes are $7.99 and these have some damage on the side so those wouldn't be worth it either Every once in a while, I can find some good shoes over here, but not too often. 
if you can find shoes, you better you better get them quick because they will go fast. So I end up I did end up finding a couple of items here. I check back with you guys and show you what I purchased at this store, and we'll be on to the next store. A few moments later. What's up, YouTube? This is a recap of um, what I purchased at the first uh, thrift store, at the first Goodwill store I, I went to. Okay, excuse my mess, y'all. This is my, this is my, uh, my uh, work room, it's my resale room. So, you know, I, I I do a lot of stuff, guys. So. You know these these are some of the stuff that I purchased uh, over the last couple of months that items that still need to be you know sold and I'm gonna get into another video one day and talk about you know the the thing about reselling okay so let's get into it let's recap so um this is a five disc CD changer. It's a home stereo system, I guess. It's a Panasonic stereo system. What DVD player? I paid. Uh, I think this was thirteen bucks. And I looked up comps on it. I put it. I put it here, right here, right there. Uh, but I could probably make a nice little profit off of this. I can probably sell this one for about 40 to 50 up to maybe 65 to 70 dollars might you know I might be able to get that much but it's okay I mean I only paid 13 bucks for it so I think that was a good deal and I found these Air Max tennis shoes at Goodwill uh, I'll put the video in here uh, where I purchased you know how much I pay for these but it was a sticker on it for like 32 bucks so I end up buying I think I end up spending maybe like $20 on these uh, the lady gave them to me for for like 20 I think 25 or 23 and I had a discount so it came out to be about $20 so these will sell for anywhere from Probably like anywhere from forty to maybe seventy five dollars. So they're in great shape. So they're practically brand new. So yeah. So that was a good deal. So I put the uh, the comp up comp up on the screen so y'all can check it out. But yeah. But that was a good buy. But I'll check back with you guys in a second to show you what I purchased at the other stores. All right and trying to figure out which one, which purchase item is going to net me the most profit. All right. I'll check, check back with you guys in a second. Hold on a second. A few moments later. Goodwill store number two. I see some vans back there. They look like those are $12. I might get those. And what are these? I don't know what these are. I have to look at them. A few moments later. What's up, guys? What's up, guys? I'm back. So this is a recap of the. Uh, I think I bought these at the second Goodwill store that I went to. Uh, these are Nike. Excuse me. These are not Nike. These are New Balance. Uh, 627 they're uh, they are work shoes steel toes I paid $23 for these but uh, these have comps up to maybe like 69 or $75 or something like that but these are in excellent shape I mean you know 23 bucks I mean they're in great shape I mean barely worn so I think I got a good deal for I, I think I did good on these. So I got them listed. I think I got these listed for sixty nine dollars. So shouldn't make a nice profit on these. They pretty heavy too. So I guess because they're still still toes. But the last Goodwill store I went to, I went to four Goodwill stores today. So 
And let me show you what else I got. Um, these Converse were the last ones. This is from the last store. Uh, the fourth store that I went to. The third store, I didn't find anything at that at that Goodwill. But it's all good. But uh, but I found these. These are in great shape. Converse. They are size 11, I think. 11 or 11 and a half. These should sell quick. People like red, the red color. So I think I, I paid $7.99 for those. So these should sell for about anywhere from 15 to 20 bucks. Uh, but yeah that's what I found so out of all everything that I purchased my best deal is probably gonna be I want to say probably I want to say these might be the best deal I might make the most money on these or it's gonna be either out of this or out of the Nikes that I purchased which are these right here these are the one I purchased so so out of all these pair of shoes I did sell the vans the ones I showed earlier they did sell I paid twelve dollars for those but I end up selling them for only I think eighteen dollars or something like that they sold already I, I just somebody gave me an offer on them I just took it you know hey you know the, the name of the game is just just keep buying keep flipping you know you're not gonna make a huge profits on everything you purchase every time, so that's just part of part of the hustle. But anyway, guys, um, let me turn you guys around so you can see my face. So I appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Press that subscribe button. And I'll, until the next video, I see y'all later. Keep hustling. Peace. Check it out, Hustle Man is in the house. <laughs> wow, 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 wow.